Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome to season 8 episode 17 of the Wild Wage Create Universe. The past two weeks, Wild Wage and John Moxley has defended the AEW Tag Team Championship against the Lucha Bros and the Hardy Boys respectively and both times they walked out with the AEW Tag Team Championships they defeated two of the best teams AEW has to offer. For some reason tonight, Ryan Page has a one-on-one -on -one match against Sammy Guevara. I'm assuming there will be no open challenge here tonight. And I have absolutely no idea why. As Ryan Page said, he wants to establish the AEW Tag Team Championships as the most prestigious championships in AEW. But tonight he has a one-on-one -on -one match. So don't go anywhere. result. Yeah, stupid. Toss back into the ring. He's channeling the crowd's energy. Strike after strike after strike to the body. Here's a cover. Could be it. Kicks out after one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left. Points it up. This has been a colossal battle to this point. No superstar is showing signs of backing down. We are seeing all their best. Look at this! Slingshot, somersault, punch shot. 
just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Brought out of ringside and back to the mat. Evading offense. Unpacks a one nice punch. Drop it right to the spine. Clear the deck. Cannonball coming through. The advantage now is squarely in his corner. Yeah, see, he wants it one more time. Can he take advantage of this? The cover. Hangs on by a thread. I truly thought it was all over there. Talk about resilience. Yeah, but did you see how the referee had to get into position? That was all the difference. And you got to think that all the plans are out the window after that. To reverse. Yeah, but he needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. Punching their way out of that one. He's getting pushed down into the defensive. This is where the doors become so important in the late stages of the match. Crushing knee strike. Oh, right in there. And he said, you're not hit me with that this time. Measuring it up one more time. Point. He's on the road to the left. Wiser stops the count. Listen to this place. Fails to connect on the springboard. He's about to do it. He's about to do it again. Down with the cutter. Yet another big move. Guys. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner is none other than Ryan Wage. Over the past two weeks, Max and I defended our tag team championships in two epic encounters. It was my goal to make these championships the most prestigious championships in all of league wrestling. But Max has however decided he wants to focus on winning the AEW championship again. Now I do not blame him for this and I'm not angry at him. I understand 100%. We agreed that the tag team championships will not be a burden to our goals as single stars. I got myself in this situation and I do not want him to suffer from the consequences of my actions. The open challenges we did gave me purpose for a short amount of time. But now, I can't help but feel I have nothing left to accomplish in this company. Don't get me wrong, I love being here, but it just doesn't stimulate me anymore. What the? Could it be? It's the inaugural TNT Champion Cody Rhodes. I never thought I'd see this showdown, but we are about to witness it. Two of the greatest professional wrestlers of all time are about to come face to face. And don't forget guys, Wage handed Cody the Universal Championship on the debut pay-per-view. And Cody burned it to the ground, so I don't believe there's bad blood between these two. What will Cody have to say? Well hello there Ryan, I do not believe we have been formally introduced. My name is Cody Rhodes and I am the son of the late great Dusty Rhodes. Now you don't need to introduce yourself, I know exactly who you are. The two of us were in the WWE together for about two years before I decided to part ways with them. The reason you might not be aware of who I am it's because I was treated like a jobber by the WWE and I was stuck in the lower midcard. But once I left, I showed the world exactly who the hell Cody Rhodes is. Oh, don't worry. I know exactly who the hell you are. I also know that you are one of the pioneers of All Elite Wrestling. I knew you wanted to get revenge on the WWE for underestimating you. And that's why I handed you the Universal Championship at double or nothing. I told Tony there's no one else who deserves to destroy the WWE's only world championship more than you, and Tony agreed. So Cody, what do you want to talk about? Me and the rest of AEW management will never be able to thank you enough for the opportunity you have given us. 
You see, when Tony told me he managed to clinch a deal with the one and only Brian Rage, he had me buzzing with excitement. And the reason for that is because just like MJF, I can't help but feel a little bit jealous at everything you have accomplished in the WWE. I know my father would have been much prouder of me if I have accomplished everything you have. Now I know you don't feel like AEW is the best place for you to be at the moment, but let me tell you, there's no better place to be despite the circumstances you are in. All the guys in the back wants to see how they do against the 6 time WrestleMania main eventer. You are the measuring stick in AEW and you will have the best matches of your career in this company. World Championship on the line or not? Now that's out of the way, let me tell you that I want to be the next man to measure myself against you and I want to do it at our next pay per view, Full Gear. And if it makes you feel like you have purpose here again, I will even put my TNT Championship on the line. Think about it, you can become the first ever double champion in AEW and you have absolutely nothing to lose. Well you have me there Cody, I am a history maker and becoming the first ever double champion in this company is the biggest possible thing I can achieve at the moment. I accept your challenge and since you are handing me a shot at your championship, I want to hand you a shot at mine as well. You and your brother Dustin against me and my brother John Moxley for the tag team championships. How can I say no to an offer like that? I accept, we will see you next week. Well ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, the first time ever Ryan Rage and Cody Rhodes has come face to face and they agreed that Cody will defend the TNT Championship against Ryan Rage at full gear and in exchange for that, Rage has agreed to defend the Tag Team Championships against Cody and Dustin next week, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button ladies and gentlemen, I will see you all next time. Thank you for tuning in.